Everything in order. Yep. Mm-hmm. So, Nox, I've been taking pics of whatever catches my eye, but what do you want to see? What does it matter? Not my camera. Yeah, I guess you have a point. What I'm talking Looking about. The kids got it bad. There are worse vices, I suppose. Done for the day. <laughs> Excuse me. We'd like to ride the chocobos. The chocobos, huh? I hate to break this to y'all, but we can't permit our birds to leave the post. Not while Deadeye's still about. He's an uncommonly ferocious behemoth that's taken to prowling these parts of late. He said makes our birds nervous. And to prevent accidents and tragedies, we have no choice but to suspend rentals. But hold on now. Ain't you lads the hunters that have been making a mark? You reckon you could handle the likes of Deadeye? If you could bring the beast down, there'd be a reward in it for you. But knowing the danger, I wouldn't blame you for saying no. So what'll it be today? Y'all still keeping on keeping on? Reckon I could ask for your help? Best of luck to you. Y'all be careful out there. Better make tracks. Ignis, we're going. On my way. Something's amiss.
on the right. No eye, no horn. We'll stay in range until we can exploit its blind spot. Exercise due caution. We've got the beast in our sight. Uh, but no plan of attack. The behemoth should be headed back to its lair, where we can catch it fully off guard. Yeah, as long as we stay on guard ourselves. <laughs>
haul in a day's work. Dun, 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 dun,
Sounds like sounds in a good mood. Basking in our hard-fought victory, I presume. Safe and sound. Uh... You boys did it. You took down Deadeye. The area's safe again, and we owe it all to you. On behalf of the locals, I give you my heartfelt thanks. So, about the chocobos? Our birds are at your disposal. You can rent them anytime you like. Boy, you really saved our hides. Mighty fine hunters, if ever I seen them. Woohoo! <laughs> Come on, Noct! Let's go for a ride! Ready to rumble, not In King's Night? Oh yeah, I'm game. In that case, I'll join you. Ready for more? You bet. Let's hit it. Infamous disc. Hey, Noct, don't you want to get a shot of you in the meteor? Uh, not right now. Oh, come on. If not now, when?
We've reached a creature crossing. Wow. Where do you think they're all going? We could always follow them and find out. I might have asked before, but is Ebony really all that good? I might have answered before, but yes it is. Like we're warping to another dimension. Wonder where we'll end up. Wow! Nice. This place is pretty big. I haven't enjoyed the city life in a while. They've even got a cable car! I'd like to see where it leads. <sighs> it's getting hot out here. Just need to pull in somewhere cool. <laughs> yeah. Any chance of sleeping in a nice room tonight? Yes, I'm certain we can secure suitable accommodations nearby. Got cup noodles outside the city. All right. And a few servings in the event our pantry runs bare. I'll put it on the list. One hell of a crowd. Oh, this must be the main thoroughfare. <clears throat> She's at the Laville. Let's go. Wife got a promotion. Congrats. What's wrong? My head just started throbbing. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. You guys holding your own out there. <laughs> what can I say? You look good. All things considered, you guys are staying here, right? That's the plan. When you have time, we have catching up to do. Sure. Jared and Talcott, is it good to see you? Quinn's Noctis! 
Iris is safe with me. <laughs> Please excuse my grandson. He has yet to learn his manners. I like it. Your Highness is very kind. But we shan't impose. A very good night to you, Your Highness. So, Iris, what was it like inside the Crown City? Not pretty. The Citadel took a beating. But a lot of outlying neighborhoods made it through in one piece. The Empire had tactical targets in mind. You know, if there's anything else, you can ask me. Yeah, uh, uh thanks. <clears throat> uh, what? So... About Lady Luna Freya. I keep hearing she was in town. <laughs> Apparently she left right away. But at least it means she's okay. Good to hear. Thanks. Yeah, well, get a good night's rest. Morning, sleepyhead. Morning. Where is everyone? Oh, they're out walking with Talcott. They went to see the sights. We should, too. Sure. Why not? Great. I'll show you around. It seems your patience was rewarded. Enjoy your walk, and please take care. For our first stop, we'll check out the marketplace. Follow me, right this way. Where do you want to go? <sighs> it's even more beautiful out here at night. This is the Partella Market. You can get almost anything here. <laughs> Isn't it great? I'd buy out the whole place if... All these shops seem right up your alley. You know me so well. Neat stuff. I'm gonna take a look. Give me just a sec. Done. Next, we're gonna see the power plant. What are you going to do when we get to Kayim? Me? Um, get ready to go to Altisha, I guess. Right. Can't keep Lady Luna waiting. That's the power plant. The driving force behind Lestalem's prosperity. But get this. Only women work there. As a matter of fact, women are the ones who do all the work in this town.
Sounds like a hard life. Uh, I think it's kind of cool, actually. Depends on how you look at it, I guess. All right. Next, we're going to the Outlook. I'm a city girl, but I dig the rustic charm. Huh? drinks in this place. What I? The people actually ride here all the way from the Chocobo post. It must be tough. Imagine taking one for a spin. Oh, yeah. Regular outlook. Amazing view, right? Look! There's the meteor! You know, Noct, this almost feels like a date. If it were, your brother would kick my ass. <laughs> well, we better keep it quiet then. And besides, you already have Lady Luna Freya. The others are probably back at the hotel by now. Let's join them. You can meet Professor Yegre this time. She's weird. I want to be a hunter. <sighs> the breeze feels so good. <sighs> Others are back. <laughs> Haven't had fun like this since we were kids. Thanks, Noct. No sweat. I had fun too. <laughs> you did? I'm so happy to hear that. Anyway, the thing I bought today, it's for you. But it's a surprise, so you're gonna have to wait. Look who's back! Talkit, go on and tell him what you told me. You got it! Oh, come now, show some respect. Whoa, no need to respect me. I'm not royalty. So, there's this legend about a sword, and the sword's supposed to be behind a waterfall nearby. It may well be one of the lost tombs. Check it out. Sure. Thanks for the tip, Talkit. You're welcome. Selling seafood like they have in Galdi. Go a bit class.
Hey, who are you after this time? Pleasure doing business. Hey, come again. shakes your brain aches yeah a sort of seismic shock to the system curious Folk here are real friendly. Yeah, everybody greets you. Takes some getting used to. You draw more attention here than you do at home.
Great day for a walk, huh? That does it for the downpour. Going in. Without any kind of plan? Crush the opposition. That's the plan. Try this. We're outnumbered. I propose we take them out one by one. Did you propose a way to finish this faster? with a new recipe. <laughs> I could taste test for you. The legend says to look behind the waterfall. What does the waterfall say? I think it says, come in. Know it. An entrance. Looks like the legend check. <laughs> this place gives me goosebumps. Well, looking on the bright side, maybe the cold keeps the demons yeah, at bay? Because monsters like warmth. Ah, sarcasm. Hmm. But what if it There's our warm welcome. <laughs> Prayers. <laughs> 
So much for a little chill. I really hope we didn't come here for nothing. Again. Really. things up in here. Oh yeah. So, the glaive is through here? Most likely. Let's see for ourselves.
Starving to death, and yet we're all very much alive. Knocked. You okay? What did I? Where was that? What is it? A hole in the ground. Something burning. The meteor? You saw the disk of Corthus. Let's make our way back to Lestalem. Yeah, gotta report to Talcott. Some shopping. Might not be a bad idea to stock up. It could crash right here.
Damn, this place is hot. Just take your shirt off. Like you? No way. What, too embarrassed to show your scrawny body? Hey, I got muscle. You just can't see it. If you say so. story came to a happy end. <laughs> well, well. <sighs> Not again. What's the matter? You all right? He'll be fine, don't worry. But we ought to take a closer look at this so-called disc. Then look no further than the Outlook. We can use the viewer things. No substitute for being on site, but it would be a start. Let's see what we can glean of Nock's condition. What a coincidence. I'm not so sure it is. Aren't nursery rhymes curious things? Like this one. From the deep, the Archean calls. Yet on deaf ears, the god's tongue falls. The king made to kneel in pain, he crawls. So how do we keep him on his feet? You need only heed the call. Visit the Archean and hear his plea. I can take you. We in? I don't know. We take a ride. But watch our backs. Fair enough. Let's do it. I'm not one to stand on ceremony, but such an occasion calls for an introduction. Please call me Odd. Come with me to the car park. That's where I left my automobile. She's a dear old thing. Pales next to your regalia. But she's never let me down. So, we take two vehicles. A convoy of sorts, shall we? All set. Allow me to do the honor of assigning your driver. I choose you. Fine by me. You drive your car and I drive mine. With that decided, let us be off.
Just to be clear, this isn't a race, it is a chase. You're not to pass me. Lose sight of me, and you'll lose your way. And no tailgating. An accident would spoil the trip. All right, all right. Let's hit the road already. As you wish. Drive safely now. First Galden and then Lestalem. What a coincidence, huh? Way too convenient to be a coincidence. I reckon he's following us around. But to what end? That question bothers me deeply, as does his origin. It's hard for me to picture that guy in the Empire. But it's even harder to imagine him as a Lucian. I'd sooner not rely on him. But he may be our only way in to the Disk of Kothis. What's his highness's opinion of this, Arden? <sighs> Don't really have one. He's nothing more than a creepy old dude to me. <laughs> you hit the nail on the head right there. Well, that's why we came up with a plan. Gotta watch our backs the whole way. Knocked. How are the headaches? Fine for now, but they come without warning. Wouldn't want to have one behind the wheel. Stop if you need to, all right? So, any havens along the way? Oh, somebody wants to camp. Somebody else wants a proper bed. Nice firm ground's much better for your back. Can't we at least make it a caravan? I don't get why you like camping so much. Under the stars, at one with nature. What's not to like? Now in the wild, there are no rules to follow. No checkout time. I dust. What say we call it a day here? What say we continue on to Carthus? The Archeum's not going anywhere? Neither are we under your stewardship. So we make camp with Arden. Hell no. <sighs> Might as well get the tent up. Oh, I'm afraid I've never really been one for the outdoors. I shall foot the bill, so let us stay at the caravan over yonder. Now this feels like a road trip. Yeah, go figure.